Read carefully the instructions in the machine handbook and the safety leaflet supplied with the saw. Use the correct size and type of guard recommended for cutting off. Check the marking. Declaration of conformity to the standard EN 13236. Not for grinding, only suitable for cutting off. The speed in RPM marked on the saw is equal to or greater than the speed marked on the machine. Direction of rotation. Follow any instruction on material suitability given by the manufacturer. Do not use a damaged saw. To be safe, make sure the machine is isolated. Fit the guard for cutting off and check that it is correctly adjusted to protect you from debris, especially in case of breakage. Never use a machine without a guard. Fit the handle. Locate the back flange on the keyway. Then the saw in the correct direction of rotation as marked on the machine, without force or excessive play. Then fit the front flange and make sure it clamps the saw. Press the spindle locking button. Tighten with the pin spanner without excessive force. Wear your personal protective equipment. Suitable clothing, mask, eye protection, ear protection, protective gloves. Make sure that the workpiece cannot move, that the working area is clean and tidy, and that no other person is at risk. Reconnect the machine, start it, and let it run freely at least 30 seconds to ensure that the saw does not break or run with excessive vibration. Work in a stable position. Always hold an angle grinder with both hands. Cut straight, swinging back and forth. Never twist in the cut or force the cut, which could damage the saw. After turning off the machine, wait until the saw has stopped running before putting down the machine and unplug it. Never force the saw to stop. Remove the saw if it is not to be used again. Never grind with the saw because it is not designed to do this. It could lose a segment or be damaged. Follow all the safety recommendations to avoid serious injury. In case of injury, call the emergency services.